we're back at it with another 616 game this one after midnight now this is basically about a boy named brad who's home alone every night father and mother work at a hospital well his mother does he has no father and uh she's away on night shift after getting some unknown messages on his cell phone things start to get really really weird one thing I know is all these 616 games have banger songs. Banger. This is no exception. Yeah. All right. Fuck all going on. Bag of Lay's potato chips up in this bitch. I'm going to have this place lit up like fucking Disneyland. Home alone. Playing as a young boy. Fuck, what am I? A bit wide? Can't get out of the door. Is there a crouch? There is. Hi, there's a run. The window was broken for a second there. All right. Keep on rolling, baby. Men's socks. Men's socks. I don't think they've got that many socks. I think that they just got a lot of boxes that socks came in living room I've said look at this old thing you can see outside bookshelf yeah. I that drawing is a bit fucked but whatever Ooh. gotta be kidding me how old is this kid who has her under mummy in his phone he's old enough to have a phone so he shouldn't be calling a mum in for, for sure that's just too old Brad don't go to bed too late remember to lock the doors don't worry mum I'll be fine nah he ain't talking like that dinner's in the oven don't open the door to anyone all right thanks mum thanks mum now i'm going back to work i love you son i call bullshit which kid do you know that says until tomorrow i love you it's like he just drops his phone oh all right not a fan of this fucking Yo, for real, 616. I love a good trash can with fucking flies around this bitch. Oh, snacky poosh. Oh, chemicals, what else? What do we got here? Oven, nothing. Spaghetti. Oh, yes, please. This is spoiled, but... It... <sighs> Let me test it. Probably didn't need to throw the whole fucking tray out, but whatever. What do I know? I'm just a kid. Back door. I don't like there's a back door. It's oh, it's locked. Okay, we want to leave it that way. Can't get through the secret door. Uh oh. I can't. I can't lock it again. Oh, we're dead. Okay, never mind. We're alive. Uh, some sort of dining area. A lot of fucking bookshelves that hide floors in the house. Dual washing machines, you know. 
maybe for mum's nursing clothes. Clothes? Clothes? Covered in blood, guts and ass. Or for her dildos. I don't know, man. I'm not... I don't know what mum does. I don't even know what I'm supposed to do. I don't want to sleep yet. I'm going to watch a movie. Hi. Living room's over yonder. Yo. It's a fucking creepy looking neighbourhood. I ain't going to lie. Uh, tape. 616 logo on the front. Look at that. Psst. Let's get it. Wait, what was that? Oh, it's a bit of... What's that flying across the screen like an orb? You see that? What the fuck movie am I watching that's just a compilation of a movie? What's that called? Ass. <laughs> Who the fuck in all aliens landing on Earth probing my asshole is that? Yo. Yo, where's my phone? Mom's. SMS my mom's and shit. Nope. Yep, of course I can't. I'm gonna die. Good, good, good. I'm just gonna run away. Hey! Hello, little boy. Who is it? How do you have my number? I'm a friend. Your night will be special. Leave me alone. My dad is a police officer and he's here. You don't have a father, Brad. And you're all alone after midnight. I meet you. Fucking hell, that's creepy. Please, leave me alone in the centre of the screen. Fuck me, what do I do? These doors better not be like unlocked. Shit! I'll see if the doors are locked. Yeah, well, they're locked. <gasps> Get fucking jerker. Oh. I'm getting paranoid. I think this is just the other side of the laundry, right? <gasps> I seen him. He smooth criminal his ass past there. I've seen him moonwalking. What the fuck? The doors are locked. I'm freaking out, man. I'm freaking out. I've got to open every... Well, open. Turn on every light that we can. This is that door that you can't get through. He's going to jump out of anywhere, isn't he? I'm so fucking paranoid. I can't even run straight. I'm going up behind my room. Yep. Pretty sweet that this is my room. I've got my own little ensuite. This is my mum's room. Is this my mum's room? She doesn't even have an ensuite. She's just got a fucking little chamber pot to piss in there. Wait. Is that my mum's room? Well, maybe mum sleeps in here. I got no idea where to go. I ain't unlocking shit. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Maybe it wants me to lock and unlock the doors just to check. Yep, locked. We're good, we're good, we're good. You can't, you ain't gonna want to test me, no way to test me. Wait, can 
casi difícil de Yo. Not quite sure what to do moving forward. She said don't open the door for anyone. Well, this is exactly how you die in a horror movie. Just don't feel like I can do any more. I'm fuck this. Maybe I will go and hide in my bedroom. Why did I not open that drawer? Sleep? Fuck yeah, fuck it. Go to sleep. Whew. I don't know how I feel about this. Is that it? Game over, I'm safe. Could have rang the bell at this time of night. We need to go look, man. I don't need it now. Really? You have a flashlight right there, and you're not gonna. Nobody. Very strict. Oh. Midnight. Yo. Alright. I'm checking every inch of this fucking house. <laughs> Fuck. Holy shit. They're in the house. What do I do? What do I do? Flashlight, flashlight. In my bedroom. Whew. Fuck, really? I'm in the house. Bad time to run out of energy, huh? Well, I call it power, but you know, whatever. It is a bad time, man. I wonder if I can hide in here, just out of curiosity. That could be a good hiding place, y'all. I don't like this. Just not even sure what to do here. I'm leaving these doors open because. likely to come in and fucking hide <gasps> what does this guy want I'll check if everything is okay oh one door is going to be unlocked it's locked it's locked it's fucking spamming me man oh thank god mommy Brad, the power went out in the entire city. Is everything okay? Mum, I'm scared. I received some unknown messages. Should be dismissive. Did you lock the doors? Don't worry. It must be someone playing a prank. What I said. It's all locked up, Mum. But I saw someone hanging around our house. So don't even think about leaving the house. Mum needs to get back to work. All right, I'll be fine. I'm telling you, 
It's fucking bullshit. Mom needs to get back to work. I- I'm telling you, that's not how that would work. Mom, I got no power. And there's something and someone outside. Oh, that's okay. I'll just work, dear. You just fucking die. Can we go back to sleep? I'm very sleepy, but I won't sleep in the darkness. What the fuck do you want me to do about it? Do I have to go outside? I don't want to. I think I have to, though. This looks like one of those fucking scenarios where you're going to change like a fuse in the garage or something. Maybe something at the back. What? Is that all I had to do? Energy's back? He turned the flashlight off. Means I can go to sleep now because all the lights are on. Oh, for fuck's sake. I prefer no lights. I like the dark. Mm. Do not go to sleep. I'm waiting for you to sleep. Fuck you, buddy. You know what? I'm going to sleep. Two reasons. Number one, you don't scare me. Number two, I've got a cell phone which I seem to be incapable of sending anybody else a message other than my mum, even though I've got reception, could be sending 911 a message saying, hey, some fucker's stalking me and he's outside my house and he's sending me shit and I'm just a kid and I'm home alone. Send me out some fucking police units. No, I can't do that. But the third and most important reason as to why I'm going to sleep is because it progresses the story. Shit. It's like someone broke the back door glass. How you could possibly fucking determine that from here is beyond me. Oh, fuck, I thought that shadow was somebody. I don't trust anything in this game. Glass is broken. <laughs> I'm inside your house. You fuck, I knew it. How did you... <sighs> Gotta find somewhere to hide. Laundry. No, you've come through that door. Can't hide in the washing machine. <gasps> Maybe I'll hide in the ensuite of my bed. I've got a feeling hiding is not an option. Where is he? <sighs> nah, he's in my bedroom, I reckon. Waiting for me. <gasps> Shit. Tonight is going to be hard. Just kidding. Fuck off. There's actually somebody there. Dylan. Good night, child. Sorry to knock on your door. So late at night. Who are you? Are you the one trying to scare me? Scare you? I know my car broke down around the corner. I need help. I'm sorry, I can't help you. Come on, boy. I just need to go in your house, use your phone. Are you home alone? Red flags. Firstly, I need to go in your home. He just said that. Look, I just need to go in, go in, in, and use your phone. And then, are you home alone? What the fuck's that got to do with using the phone? Firstly, I could yeet you my mobile phone out the fucking window. My father is here. He's sleeping. 
I'm sorry, but I really can't help. Please, boy, let me in. It's very cold in here. And I'm all wet. Mum said don't open the door for anybody. I cannot help. Please go away. Why is he taking so long to walk away? It sounds like you don't like helping people. Was that him? How did he know that? Unless it was him. Or unless he's got a microphone. I don't like this game. <gasps> oh no, not again. I need to keep the doors locked. about it. Do you think that was the dude? It was a dude. It was a dude. It was a dude. to me why don't I just text my freaking mother huh <sighs> Brad, answer me. It's urgent. Hi, Mum. What happened? The neighbour called me and said he saw someone coming into the house. I'm alone here, Mummy. Someone broke the glass in the back door. The, the neighbour called the police. If anything happens, hide under the bed. All right, Mum. Don't worry. under the bed won't let me I'm gonna die Game's glitched. I've got to go in and confront him, I think. Holy shit. Why would I leave the fucking flashlight right there?
Um, I'm going to stay hidden. Cops are on their way. Cops are on their way. <laughs> Motherfucker scared the shit out of me. Yo, <laughs> these games are wild. <laughs> These games are wild as hell. Holy smokes. Maybe I'll get out from under the bed. See if it lets me. Oh, we go from here, do we? Alright. How are you? Sorry, no, no. Go away. Oh, sounds like you don't like helping people. Yeah, I don't. No. This motherfucker is just barely leaving. It won't let me check if it's locked or unlocked while he's still walking away. What sucks is I don't even know what I could possibly do once I get out from under the bed. Mommy. Brad, answer, it's urgent. Mom, what? What happened? Someone's coming in the house. I'm alone here, mommy. Someone broke the glass on the back door. All right, mommy. Don't worry. Never call the police. Get under the bed if anything happens. <laughs> wow, that was quick. Motherfucker right here. It's the moment of truth. Yes. I live. Live to fight another day. Yo, what a game. Every single one of these 616 games, I love how it gets the hairs on the back of my neck standing up. That soundtrack is wild, though. Absolutely wild. It's another one from the Trash Horror Collection. Oh, and that one was called After Midnight. I can't recommend these games enough. The 616 Trash Horror Collection. There are four of them. You should check them out on Steam if you can. They're really, really good.